Hey, are you considering ways to keep your portfolio ahead of inflation? I'm here today with somebody that historically I'm crazy about, and that's George Washington. George's picture is on the uh, $1 bill, and I constantly have people say to me, you know, my dollar just doesn't do as much for me as it used to. I used to buy a lot more. I'm having retirees come to me saying, you know what? My budget from last year has been shot. I'm paying more in gasoline. Uh, I'm paying more for food. Uh, these are hidden inflation costs that are starting to show up in our economy. Uh, based on how the government has printed money, uh, there's a good chance, maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but over the next few years, we're going to see inflation continue to go up, and it's going to cost you more to do things. Now, the reason I'm bringing this up is that is your portfolio designed to stay ahead of inflation? Do you currently have your money just parked maybe in money market and CDs? Well, guess what? That's not enough to stay ahead of inflation. Are you having conversations with your financial advisor to discuss ways for your portfolio to generate more income as well as to get growth for you without taking a tremendous amount of risk? That's the kind of dialogue, especially if you're retired, that you need to be having with your financial advisor. I know our founding fathers wanted people to not only have freedom, but the quality of life that they wanted to live. And so the pursuit of happiness, as I call it. That said, here at Five Plan Partners, when we do a comprehensive financial blueprint, we project out what inflation can do to the good old-fashioned dollar, and at the same time, how much it's going to cost somebody not only to live their lifestyle today, but down the road. So make sure that you're having that conversation that it's not just about your portfolio today. It's also later on when you retire or if you're already retired, is this portfolio going to be able to stay ahead of inflation? If you currently, though, are working with a financial advisor who's just comparing themselves to the S&P 500 index and not really what your goals are down the road and how inflation can impact them, that's a red flag, folks. You need to be having that conversation, and you need to call me. Hope this has been informative, but also I know you can relate to it because everyone watching this vlog is paying more in gasoline and food prices, and there's more to come in regards to inflation. Thanks.